Hello, my name is Teresa and I'll be your teacher today. November 1st marks a special day in our church's calendar called All Saints Day. On this day, we are, we are reminded of all the people who have gone on before us. In our worship service, Pastor Jeff lights a candle for all the people and family and friends that have died and gone to heaven. Saints are people who helped us to follow Jesus' teachings and live in God's way. Our theme today is On the Right Road. Can you think of someone in our church or in the world that has helped you to know God's way? A few years ago, I met someone who traveled to Japan and other parts of the world as a missionary. She and her husband helped people in many ways, including showing others the love of Jesus. This is one of many things a missionary does. Did you know Jesus loved to tell stories to teach his disciples and the people living in the towns he visited? In the book of Matthew, chapter 5, verses 1 through 12, we are going to hear one of Jesus' teachings. This story is called the Sermon on the Mount. Now when he sat... Now when he saw the crowds, he went up on the mountainside and sat down. His disciples came to him, and he began to teach them, saying, Blessed are the poor in spirit, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Blessed are those who mourn, for they will be comforted. Blessed are the meek, for they will inherit the earth. Blessed are those who hunger and thirst for righteousness, for they will be filled. Blessed are the merciful, for they will be they will be shown mercy. Blessed are the pure in heart, for they will see God. Blessed are the peacemakers, for they will be called sons of God. Blessed are those who are persecuted for because of righteousness, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Well, all right, that's a lot of information. We have another little story that kind of explains it a little bit better. Or a little more simple, I should say. Let's begin our story. Jesus gathered his disciples. Come sit down, my friends. I have some important things for you to say. You might be wondering what a disciple is. A disciple is a follower of Jesus. You could say a disciple is also like a student. Jesus took time to teach them many things. Jesus began teaching, saying, Friends, when you see someone hungry, know that God has blessed them. God doesn't want anyone to be hungry, so share your food with them. When you, when you see someone who wants to know more about God, know God blesses them. God wants to help everyone know more about God's way. Be kind be kind, be kind and loving, Sh share your food and toys, and people will know that God is what God is like. When you see someone who is kind to others, know that God blesses them too. Care about others. God cares about you very much. When you see someone who is gentle know, and who doesn't hurt others, know God blesses them. This, they will always be a part of God's family. Tell others that God loves them. When you, see, when you see someone who tells the truth and is honest with God, know God blesses them too. That's a lot of blessing. God loves them and will always be with them. Tell others that we can always trust God. Friends, you are all God's children. Listen to God and listen to each other. Jesus looked around at all his friends again. You are my disciples, Jesus said. I love you and I want you to be happy. You are blessings to others when you live God's way. Living God's way is being on the right road. On this road, we are traveling on a road that leads to life. On this path, it may be challenging, but there are... There will be times when there will be justice, freedom, and love for everyone. 
In our story, Jesus uses the word blessing, well, many times, countless. Can you count them all? What does it mean to be blessed? The word blessing is from the Hebrew word ashar. It means you're on the right road. Well, when when we are on the right road, God blesses us with energy, spirit, and power when times are good and not so good. Let us bow our head and pray. Dear God, you never stop surprising us. You are always reminding us how special we are to you. Sometimes we don't understand who we really are. Help us realize that we are your children. Help us to stay on the road to your freedom, justice, mercy, and compassion. In Jesus' name, amen. Remember I was telling you about my friend who was a missionary? Well, she taught me a song as well. About It's called Count Your Blessings. Count your blessings, name them one by one. Count your blessings, see what God has done. Count your blessings, name them one by one. Count your many blessings, see what God has done. So amid the conflict, conflict, whether great or small, do not be discouraged, God is over all. Count your many blessings, angels will attend. Count help and comfort give you to your journey's end. Count your blessings, name them one by one. Count your blessings, see what God has done. Count your blessings, name them one by one. Count your many blessings, see what God has done. Well, stay tuned for our lesson next week. In the meantime, take care of yourselves. Don't forget to exercise, eat good, talk to God, pray, spend time finding some cool Bible verses to remember, keep in touch with your friends, laughing is like medicine, it makes you feel good and uh, you end up smiling, (laughs) Wear, wear your masks and stay safe and see you next time.